Good morning, everybody. It's me again, Crazy Bag Lady. Oh, sunshine. We have a bit of sunshine, the blue sky. I can hear the birds singing. Can you hear them? Okay. Birds. I can hear the little birds. Oh, it looks such a beautiful, beautiful day. I'm not sure how long the sun's going to last. I've got up far too late again. I'm so looking forward to Tuesday for everybody going back to work and school and being able to get up early again and stuff. And so it's about quarter to ten which is disgustingly late <laughs> but again like I said the other day you have to enjoy it because when you do have to get up early it makes you so tired so anyway let's enjoy a bit of sunshine my favorite makeup so I use this every day as you can see I've used nearly half a bottle it is absolutely brilliant if you've not tried this get yourself a bottle it's like youth in a bottle so good I always forget to talk about it but it is so so good you only need a tiny bit and it just lightens your skin up it's just brilliant just i don't know smooths your wrinkles out it's so good <laughs> i think the dog's very busy looking out the window <laughs> just look at her she's so funny i don't really know what she's looking at shouldn't normally sit that way around <laughs> so third cup of tea of the morning even my dog's on the mug look. <laughs> that is the ultimate way to enjoy the last bit of Christmas. It's the stunt made you laugh, honestly, it's so funny. Could a dog possibly be more comfy? Gloria bought this bed and Winnie absolutely loves it. So Gloria, if you're watching this, look how much Miss Winnie loves this bed. Our face is sunk into the fluffiness. And we'll come back to a bit of reality. A full wash basket. We could ignore it till probably Tuesday, but then it's just going to get worse. So I thought we'll put some washing in. I've still got to do my hair. I am dressed. I've got my pink trousers on again. I thought I'd keep the day nice and bright and cheerful. So let's sort the washing. Oh, right, blinds are open. And it's so nice. I've got the window open. It's so nice. Let some fresh air in. So we were going to go out today, but then I'm like, I don't really need to buy anything. We've already got enough of everything. So I think we're going to spend the day like clearing out a bit and tidying up, sorting the washing out. And yeah, just getting some fresh air in the house. Oh, my hubby washed up for me. Do you know, every room in my house is an absolute mess. You know, when you get to a point, you think, I don't know where to start. I've reached that point and... Maybe I feel better when I put all the Christmas stuff away, but I don't want to put it away for a couple more days because it's quite nice to enjoy it still, my little gonks and stuff. So oh, I'll try and put away what I can. <laughs> oh, it's clouding up a little bit, but the sun is still out. Oh, I think I need to go outside and take some deep breaths. Right, let's open this. Oh, oh the air is so warm. It's What are the men in my life doing? Not helping with housework, not helping me clean up, not cooking, not cleaning, but washing bloody cars. That's all they ever do. <laughs> Here I am. I cannot believe that it's nearly quarter past 12. The day is just flying by again. That's true when you get up late. The day just flies by. I hate getting up late, it annoys me. Um, so it's 10 past 12. I'm not ready for any dinner yet. I'm not hungry yet. So I'm gonna ring my mom and carry on pottering and putting things away. Well, while I've been on the phone to my mum, I've decided that we were going to have a Sunday dinner tomorrow, but I already can't get it in my head if it's Saturday or Sunday or Monday. So I thought, right, get yourself back on track and do a Sunday dinner today. So at least you'll know in your brain it is Sunday. So while I've been on the phone to my mum, I've made some homemade bread sauce. Um, I've got some potatoes I'm just going to bring on to the boil. Um, I'm not going to have my roast dinner till tonight because obviously I'm not really hungry at the minute. And... I just thought I'd start the prep and get everything ready. So I've got a bit of chicken, and so we're gonna have chicken, roast potatoes, bread sauce, Brussels, carrots. So I've got them all ready. Oh, so I've made everybody a nice drink. So I've made myself a cup of coffee in my mug of the day. So it's now quarter past one. Nobody seems to be hungry yet. So I'm just having a sweet. I love these Jolly Ranch sweets so much. I know they are American sweets. They are so nice. I really do like them. Bing bong. Avon calling. 
so it's time to order my Avon. I've only had one Avon order this month from my little door-to-door -door customer. So I just thought if there was anything in it that I might want myself. Um, can anyone remember when I had this last year? It was absolutely brilliant. No, it was that one. So good. So I might treat myself to some more of that. It was really, really good. It, it did lift all the like lines around your eyes. It was so good. So that's on offer for £11. Do I need that? Do I want to look younger in 2022? Of course I do. So I might treat myself to some of that. I've not tried that one, that dark circles. Oh, so much good stuff. Another one of my favorites. So if you didn't want to stretch to the other cream that I showed this morning, the serum, this is also absolutely amazing. I've had about three different bottles of this. It is so good. I know some of you did try it and some of you really did like it. So for eight pound, that, it's absolutely brilliant. I love it so much. My favourite bubble baths. Oh, I don't want to bore you just looking at Avon, but I know some of you do enjoy seeing it when you're not in the same country as us. Sometimes you find it fascinating. So my favourite bubble baths, £2 and £2.50. You can't go wrong really because they produce the biggest bubbles ever. Last couple of bits. How nice is that bag? I really like like mock crocodile. So nice. So I think it's £20. Uh, yeah, it must be, so it's £20. That's so nice. Right, we've reached that point where everybody has declared they're hungry. So I'm now rustling up some sandwiches for everybody. And then I think I'm going to have a toasted bagel because I'm going to be naughty today, naughty tomorrow. And then I'm starting on my healthy eating on Tuesday. And that is my dinner. So I've got a little bagel, a little bit of pot pie, and then I've got a piece of real nice bread toasted uh, with real butter splattered across it. Oh, delicious. I'm so excited to have this. Don't forget the feeling. We're being watched and followed. <laughs> so, oh, so my little friend is in her bed, but she does keep an eye on me. <laughs> you can just see her through the stool. Right, next job. So my dinner was really nice. I'm so full. I'm just so full of eating. Does anybody else like that now? So I'm just testing out the little bits that I got from Trash Shop the other day. So this was the little skirt I got, which somebody did say that little skirt is going to be really trendy this year. I love it. But I don't really know if it's me. I don't really know if it's the sort of thing I would wear, but maybe it would look better with a different top. It was only like £4 from Trash Shop, so it's no big deal if I keep it for a bit. Not sure if I would wear it though, but it's quite cool. But is it me? <laughs> I don't know. Right, these are the other weird things. So it's like a skirt thing, but it's not actually a skirt. It's actually shorts, which you can see. Look, well you can't hardly see, but they've got shorts and then they have this little skirt bit that goes over the top, but it almost looks like you've got no shorts on. So maybe you'd have to wear them with like clear tights or I don't really know. Not sure about these either. Ruby thinks she likes the red kilt as well. So me and Ruby are going to share the other thing. But these are just a bit weird, I think. I almost look like I'm not wearing any trousers. <laughs> Here's my blazer. So this is the blazer I got, which again, you probably shouldn't put it over a cardigan. Um, but it's got gorgeous gold buttons on the sleeves are really nice one button on the front and then this beautiful embroidery on the front pocket i did mention it to my mum it looks a bit slightly a bit tight for me doesn't it that's too much double cream and cake and stuff <laughs> um so i did mention it to my mum she might be interested in it if i want to part with it um it's what i got from cherry shot the other day it's really cool actually um yeah, very smart. So this was lovely, lovely bargain. I really need to make my mind up. My hubby said he likes this. So it looks like a little waitress's outfit. <laughs> Not sure if he was joking or whether he really does like it. Um, so cardigan, can't make my mind up. I think it was about £30. I love it, but don't know if I love it £30 worth. If it was £5 from the charity shop, then yes, I would love it. But... £30. Am I going to wear it £30 worth of times? Probably not. So if I'm answering that, it needs to go back really, doesn't it? Still multitasking. So no, not only am I trying clothes on, I'm also still sort of washing out and double drying stuff. 
Oh, it's never ending. So we're still multitasking. So everybody's had the dinner. My hubby and that have gone back outside to finish off what they're doing with James's car. Um, I can't blame them really because it soon gets dark. So I just said, yeah, get on with your car. So I've got a few pots to wash and then in about an hour, we'll put the dinner on. Lipstick of the day. So lipstick of the day is my lovely MAC lipstick set that I got from lovely Victoria. So we're glossing our way into the afternoon. <laughs> Thank you. Woohoo! Gotta keep ourselves entertained! <laughs> Back to try and close on. I do have two mini coats. Um, I have this, but it's very long. I think it's probably a little bit too big for me. I'm not sure, because I do like big oversized coats, but yeah, I think it's probably a little bit too big. Ooh, I've just realised it's raining! I can't believe it's raining. How rude! Oh, the last few days of having Christmas lights on! sad isn't it so i've started to take a few bits of tinsel down but i've left my trees for a couple more days because i just like them at night you know nothing lights up it's just so pretty look at my lipstick bubble <laughs> bubble has just arrived it's not even dark yet and bubble has arrived home so i think it's because it's raining he's probably had enough for the day little bubble Ooh. and he's already tucked into a ball he must have been back a few minutes, is he? Couple of minutes. Couple of minutes. And he soon got into his little sleep position. Oh, Come on, Bobble, you need to make it through the winter so that in summer you can have lots of babies. Oh, so it's really odd because it's gone about four o'clock. It's pouring with rain, but the sun's out. And it's like a really weird sky. I don't know if you can really see this. Um, but it's like pink and beige and it's really weird. Oh, can you see? It's just an evening that's a bit cold and you want to be all home and cosy and snug as a bug in a rug or snug as a bobble in a hut. <laughs> you can't feel little bobbles in there. Oh, he's just in there. So cute, isn't it? You can see the sun reflect on the house. That's why everything looks like it's got the golden hour on it. Can you hear the rain? A cup of coffee in me mug of the day and i'm gonna have a lindo little orange chocolate with it right it's now half past four let's get these pans bubbling and get this wonderful dinner cooked. so i've just rung my little mom she's okay bless her so it's now ten past five i'm really hungry now so i'm waiting for my tea to cook it smells so nice the bread sauce smells lovely roast potatoes smell gorgeous and brussels and the chicken oh yes but it's still going to be about another half an hour i'm so hungry so dinner's nearly ready tumble dryer is on it's been never ending today hasn't it bit of a boring day and the dinner is ready let's just take a moment to appreciate all my hard work as a lot of you probably do the same as well and you think you make it all and then in about 10 minutes it'll all be gone <laughs> so we've got beautiful roast potatoes roasted carrots chicken stuffing balls brussels um and then we've got homemade bread sauce on the top oh a really thick gravy just look at it oh sometimes people don't appreciate how much hard work goes into making a roast dinner absolutely beautiful look oh, so i'm off to enjoy my lovely lovely roast dinner that was absolutely delicious but sadly i've now got to wash up Ugh. Not so good. Well, actually, I've just got to load the dishwasher up um, and feed my little doggies. Are you ready for tea? You're hungry, aren't you? Because you've sat and watched me eat mine. Are you hungry? Hey, is that your best? <laughs> is that your best face for feed me now, please? <sighs> and just like that, it's all clean and tidy. Lovely. Right, it is. I'm going to love you and leave you because tonight's TV watching. We've got um, pottery throwdown, which me and Ruby like to watch, where they make stuff out of clay. It's a bit like sewing bee, but pottery, and we really like that. So that's on tonight. And then the next part of the tourist is also on. It was quite intriguing last night. 
uh, love Jamie Dornan, he's so good. And it just had you on the edge of your seat, it was really good. So many thanks for joining me again today. So if you do enjoy Just a Bit of Real Life, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. Don't forget my giveaways down below. We'll be drawing it very, very soon. Also, my website is down below for a mug of the day or a bag of the day. And my little Avon shop is also down below. If you spend £20, you get free UK delivery straight to your door. So I love you, leave you.